Hello to everyone and welcome to another marine engineering video here in Adventure Story Channel. And today we have this uh, small pump of chemical dosing pump for auxiliary boiler of our Alborg boilers. Okay. First of all, what we need to do here, we need to call electrician. Okay, to close one moment the power okay first of all we go to boilers panel okay computer in ecr in engine control room and then we put from computer uh, from the pump overview we put off this chemical which we will overhaul next we will switch off this switch here which is located on the top of the boilers okay on the panel of the boilers so electrician will isolate and he will also disconnect the wiring here the wiring cables and next it's our job to overhaul the pump and bring it to engine workshop okay First of all, disconnection of the cable, switch of the power, okay, make all the proper work permits before you make any switch off, okay, any cold works, uh, discuss, checking about the job, check first your spares, what spares you have, and then proceed. Also, we need to isolate the discharge valve, the suction valve, okay. This is the discharge valve on the line. We need to close that one. Okay. And also what I did, I checked the set point that what was for the dosage. Okay. Was about on 70 and something. Also the piping down here below. Okay. Down from this metal part, there is a, a suction valve which supply to this pipe and this pipe it's connecting to the pump I will show you on the back here okay on the end uh, here okay this is the pipe it's going here there is a strainer here a filter and then goes here to the ball system there is a balls metal balls like from ball bearings okay and some springs which movings up and down okay it's closing and opening and here inside it's a membrane a teflon membrane and this is the discharge area okay from here the water the chemical it's passing here with water and goes to the boiler through this valve here okay one moment uh, through this valve here okay next everything is disconnected also from the base and before you remove the discharge uh, hose okay discharge piping slowly release do not release it until to the end because it, it, it maybe there is a precise some pressure okay also wear goggles and gloves because this kind of chemical it's a little bit corrosive okay as you can see i have opened also the valve from the bottom and all the sludges and dirty what was accumulated okay through the time here was going to this plastic okay next the strainer as you see there is a lot of mud here okay it's cleaned as you can see from the light the motor is separated okay by four allen key allen uh, bolts okay and this is how it looks inside everything it's immersed here in oil there is a also a side glass which indicates the oil level okay and what is going on the motor from the top it turns here okay and then it's giving movement to this gear okay there is a gear a warm gear here and a gear here this gear turns in this side and also there is a road here with pistons connect here okay which make this movement from one side to another okay 
and also there is a membrane here that is how it looks like okay this is all the bolts this is the membrane okay it's very thick this membrane it's made by teflon and also you must be very careful for these plates how you will take out these plates but anyway if you make mistake and you change them position okay you cannot attach them here on the main housing but before you take out and you make any attempt to overhaul okay put them step by step and put them okay somewhere here just to remember how they go okay also here you can see some components okay some valves some non-return valves which passing to one side when the membrane is working it's suction and when uh, when the suction is sucked okay when it's delivered it's closed by some springs and some ball balls metal balls which goes here okay and attach here and here in these surfaces the most common problem is that on the balls that they hit through the time on the metal parts and must be replaced here i have found a ball missing okay was missing but in the drawing was shown that must be okay this is how it goes inside piece by piece okay first the spring this metal part and that and then it's tight and sealed by a o-ring okay this is where the membrane goes some holes okay some venting holes some passages here okay everything must be blown by air checked this is a lock okay some bolts go here after the lock go inside uh, just be careful how you take out and also check the diagram carefully this is new teflon replaced okay the oil is filled everything changed here teflons everything as you can see is back okay this is how it looks like when the oil is filled do not overfill and then also we paint the base here to be nice okay and clean also everything was connected all the pipes all was open and next step is to do it's to commissioning your pump okay the most important here is to open this vent here okay and vent any air from the system also you can touch by your hand this high pressure pipe here and if you feel that some like balls playing okay some metal parts heating that means your pump is working okay and also you can see from the book there is a guidance that show that uh, in how much set point you have here okay in this uh, setting okay it depends how many liters per hour will be delivered so make a good vent from here okay until water runs and then start your pump and also when you start your pump you can also open and drain until a delivery of the water will be achieved and you feel that your pump is working you can put also your head here okay on this metal pipe so you can feel better the transfer and the push of the pump of the liquid inside okay you can listen also the part how they work okay everything when it's connected okay you start also you start here the reverse okay everything and then you check if your quantity of water and chemical decreases okay that is it guys have always pairs uh, always check adventure story channel videos and don't forget to subscribe stay tuned check my new websites you will find some programs there okay i will put some programs that you can you will download you can download okay see you soon bye bye